Hey, I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome back to another episode of Yandere Simulator. There is now some new animations to certain endings in this game and a few other updates that I personally want to check out, but it's better if I show you rather than tell you. So if you guys cool with that, you down with that? Everybody get ready and buckle up, because here we go. All right, so check this out, everybody. There is now an animation to the cutscene for the true ending in 1980s mode. And there's also a cutscene in the post credits when the headmaster is talking to the dude from Psycho Corp. The reason why I'm even in the gardening club is because there's some new stuff. Ooh. Ah. Oh my goodness. But yeah, besides that, let me eliminate everybody here. Senpai is already looking like a big old bug-eyed freak. The police arrive at school. The police find more than five corpses. The police are unable to locate any murder weapons. And Ayano got away with murder. She has that shit-eating grin. Heartbroken. Embarrassing. <laughs> Wait, this is how we get the ending that I need. We just gotta snap a little. There we go. Yo, this animation though is so funny when you watch it in fast motion. Bro, the scream of a thousand corpses. Why do they all have to go bald when they go inside of the black hole? Like, look at this. Instant bald, bro. Again, haircuts. Free 99 too. Look at that. That is nightmare fuel, everybody. Good evening, sir. Thank you very much for setting aside the time to take this call. I know that you're a busy man. No, no, there haven't been any complications. I just wanted to confirm that I've been following your instructions properly. I'm glad to hear it. Are you satisfied with how events are unfolding? I'm not, because I can't see shit. Ah, oh, that's good to hear, sir. I must confess, I'm still worried about the students. I'm worried that this cutscene isn't going to get in focus. Acceptable casualties? Necessary sacrifices. I'm sacrificing my eyesight because I can't see 2020 with this. Progress. I see, sir. I don't see, sir. I wish I, I could can't view it see. from your perspective, but the thought of bloodshed in my school still makes me quite uncomfortable. You want to talk about uncomfortable? No, no, of course not, sir. Oh, there we go. Finally some I'll focus. i doing precisely as you've asked. Yes, sir. No, sir. Yes, sir. Bro, squirming uh, around like a worm. Keep you informed of any noteworthy developments. Thank you very much for your time, Mr. Psycho. So the new animated cutscene for that one was that guy talking on the phone with the Karen stance. Like, that was a pure Karen stance right there. So you all might be wondering, why am I here and why are we looking at the moon right now? And we're not here to see aliens. We're here to sneak into Osana Stalker's house because there's a new cutscene after we handle business. And I just realized that her wearing these jorts is definitely not sneaking attire. That's actually really uncomfortable now that I think about it. What the hell are you looking at? Whose OnlyFans is that? Oh shit. Huh? Whoops. He won't get away with Oh this. fuck you. What? Okay. Alright, you wanna go? You wanna tussle, bitch? Look at this. Oh, kick him in the balls. Bop. So this is the new cutscene with the new animation. It better be good. Or else. You have a nice place, I'm returning that cat back to the stalker's house. Thanks. Where are your parents? Dead. Overseas. So you take care of yourself? That must be hard. What do you mean? Feeding myself, it. taking a shower, going to school? Well, thank you again it ain't for that hard. My cat and saving me from that stalker. That was a horrible experience. I'm so glad it's all over. Osana looks high as shit. That's the new animation? The tea is ready. Her look in blaze right out of her back. skull? Feel free to keep talking. I can't imagine what it's like to become obsessed with someone after meeting them for the first time. Irony! It doesn't make any sense. <laughs> I'm shocked that there are people in this world Serve normal to tea or serve the drug tea. Right Let's go normal That's one insane. time. He said he loved me. Yo, why does she look so goddamn it evil? Was, it was just a sick, twisted obsession that he believed was love. She has so much attitude. I wish I didn't save her cat. But starting today, I won't have to worry about it anymore. It's all thanks to you. Here's your tea. Thank She's you. like, shut up, here's your tea. Oh, I just realized I've been rambling this entire time. You said you had something important to tell me, right? Yes. It's about the boy from class 3 too. The boy you have a crush on. Huh? I don't have a crush on him. Imagine she He's pulls out a gun and friend. she's like, that's I'm gonna need you to stop it right now. If that's true, then you wouldn't mind. I like how the I drugs are just on the my table. Love to him. <laughs> <laughs> They're just chilling right there out in the open. Ayano gives no fooks. Left? 
Are you saying that you have feelings for him? Yes. Look at that, it's right Deep there too. Feelings. I've never felt this way about anyone before. You might as well have a syringe on and the table I too. I can't bear the thought of seeing him with anyone else. Like you might as well put a gun I on the know table. That you love That's him. how obvious you're trying to be. And I know that this is a selfish request. But But what? Please don't take him away from me. Let me try to win his heart. She's like, about that. We've actually been dating Sadly, for three weeks now. It's true. I do have feelings for him. But after everything you've done for me, I could never take someone away from you. Everything you've done for me, a.k.a. rescue my cat, and that's it? Okay. I'll do as you've asked. I'll stay away from him. Thank you. But you'd better take really good care of him, okay? Don't worry. I will. I can't believe it's that easy to get rid of Osana. <laughs> what? What the fuck? Yo, she's a wizard, Harry. She just freaking disappeared. She teleported into Senpai's house or something because I don't know where she went. That's freaking funny as hell. <laughs> she said, don't worry. I will instantly teleports out of that bitch so, so this time we are gonna serve the drug tea let's see what the new cutscene looking like loved me, but her eyes will not love. fully open no matter what sick, twisted obsession she's like a million dollars to open your eyes it makes me feel sick but starting today i won't have to worry about it anymore it's all thanks to you here's your tea thank you oh i just realized i've been rambling this entire time you yeah, do you, you ever shut up? Important to tell me, right? Yes. It's about the boy from class 3 too. The boy you have a crush on. Huh? I I don't I don't have a crush on Uh-oh. Someone's Something's feeling <sighs> Someone's I feeling a little, so... <sighs> yeah, a little sleepy. sleepy. Oh man, this couch is looking pretty Why nice. You... you have a blanket? Smile. Can I get a blanket and a pillow, please? Cause I'm feeling. <laughs> what is this? Why am I tied to a chair? Why are you doing this? This isn't funny. Let me go. Let me go right now. All right. So that was the new cutscene for the Osana elimination when you befriend or betray her. The other one that we got to check out is from the 1980s mode. We have to get the true ending, meaning I have to eliminate all 10 rivals and get the S plus rank. So if this animation is lame as fook, I am going to live stream myself plucking my own butthole hairs just so you could see the same pain on my face as me having to go through this shit again. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I just eliminated all 10 rivals. I won't say that that I did it the best way, but Kaguya was killed with a weapon. The police know that she was murdered, but don't know who killed her. Come on now, talk to me. Moeko was killed with a weapon. They don't know who killed her. Onami, killed with a weapon, but they don't know who killed her. Sumiko, weapon, don't know. Ritsuko, we don't know. Ai, no way. Taiko, no way so. Komako, Chigusa. After Sumida's disappearance, the police were called to Academia a total of 11 times. Oh no! The police discovered a total of 11 corpses at Academy. Ryoba made nine friends at Academy. Nine friends? I don't even remember making one friend. Ryoba's reputation at school is 58. Can't even get a 60? Ryoba's classmates witnessed her doing something sus four times. Ryoba's classmates witnessed her carrying a dangerous weapon around school zero times. Hey! Ryoba's classmates witnessed her walking around in bloodstained clothing zero times. Hey, hey! Zero students testified that they witnessed Ryoba commit murder. Hey, hey, hey! Let's go, Taking come all on, of man. The facts into consideration, Talk to me. It is clear. Talk to beyond me. Beyond any shadow Talk to of me a doubt nice. that Ryoba Aishi is responsible for at least one death what? over the past 11 weeks. Who? What do you mean? Come on, give me an S. Plus. Oh my goodness, she fainted. F! I gotta do that again. <laughs> I gotta do that again! Taking all of the facts into consideration, it is clear beyond any shadow of a doubt. Swear to God, you better tell me something good, Mr. Mustachio. That Ryoba Aishi is innocent of all charges. Thank goodness, what did I get? Come on now, S plus, baby. Hey! 
All right, everybody. So I ran through 1980s mode twice. So that means I killed 20 rivals in total, but my dumbass didn't get the S plus ending, AKA the true ending. So I wanted to see if anybody else got it so far. And this person named Blood got it. So I just want to give them all the credit because they went through the whole thing and got the S plus ending. So go show them some support. I'll leave the link to their channel in the description box below. But we are going to check out the S plus cutscene because I am not doing it for a third time. Hate me or love me, I'm not doing that for a third time, okay? So we are gonna check this out together and let's see what this cutscene looks like. Hi, I'm back from the star. I made sure to buy all of your favorite. Oops. That's awkward. Senpai? Senpai! No, no, no. This can't be happening. Senpai! Senpai! Where are you? Oh, no, no, no. Why would you leave me? She does not we look like a high school progress. student. I thought you were finally starting to... She looked like she's 40, 40 years old with like three kids. What? The letter? Dear Ryobaishi, we have taken your senpai out for some fresh air. We have no intention of harming him. That's why you kidnapped him. We will them. return him to you, but first, you must pass a test. Come to the row of abandoned warehouses outside of town. We will be in warehouse 879. Bring whatever you want with you, but come alone. Imagine she you brings a bazooka. Have one hour. Signed, Saisho Psycho, CEO and founder of Psycho Corp. And that was it, everybody. I'm not even gonna lie to you, trying to get the S plus ending by doing it for a third time would have been so not worth it. Remember when I said that I would live stream plucking my butthole hairs? There actually is one more thing I wanna check out. So I need Osana to meet me behind the school at right now o'clock. So I didn't actually know that we can enable a camera once we drop the air unit. So let me equip death cam. Wait, nobody's even here? Hold on, Osana? Osana, we're out there, Osana! Mother. Okay. So, I think Osana's coming soon. Did I choose the wrong thing? It's I am just stupid. A prank. I am Captain El Stupido. Okay, there she is coming up. So, let's unscrew this and equip the death cam. There you go. She's just chilling. Not for long. Bada bing, bada boom. And. Ooh! Bitch! Alright, everybody, but that's gonna do it for this episode of Yandere Simulator. Sorry this episode was so short. I just wanted to check out a few things, and I kind of just wanted to see these bald heads again in this black hole mode. And shout out to Blood again for getting that S plus true ending because I couldn't do it, and I still feel bad for it, but at least we saw what it was. And to be honest, I don't even think it was worth getting S plus again for. But hopefully you all enjoyed this episode anyway. If you want me to record any more updates in the future, make sure you give this video one big fat like. I tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude!